The story opens with an unknown figure cutting open a man's brain and replacing part of it with a machine. The man has the image of the phoenix burned in his eyes. The scene shifts to Wolverine who gives a eulogy for Professor Xavier. Meanwhile, Alexander Summers visits his brother in jail. They argue about what Cyclops did, and after Havoc leaves, he is approached by Captain America and Thor. Captain America offers Havoc a spot on the Avengers, and to lead a squad of both Avengers and X-Men in order to represent mutant kind. Havoc refuses them, however. Meanwhile, the man who had part of his brain removed is revealed to be Avalanche, who goes on a rampage in the middle of town. Captain America, Thor, and Havoc team up to stop him, and he throws himself off of a cliff. Meanwhile, the Scarlet Witch visits Professor Xavier's grave. Rogue shows up and tries to force Scarlet Witch to leave, and they begin arguing. The argument turns physical, but they are interrupted by a team of superhumans who steal Professor Xavier's corpse, capture them, and take them back to a base. Inside the base, the Red Skull has cut out Charles's brain and declares that he will use it to eradicate the mutant menace.